Are we gonna are we gonna get a Death Star? We getting a Death Star! <laughs> Hello friends, my name is Brandon Date and I'm your humble narrator. Welcome to Dominari Tournament. This game's still in development, but it's a relatively simple space-based RTS. So we'll jump into it, show you a little bit about what it do. Uh, you can play online and such, but currently there are no online games in play. One player? Is that me? Am I the only player? Oh, that's that's sad. Okay, <laughs> but uh, I'm gonna play against the computer, so I guess that's just fine. Single player versus AI, and we'll uh, we'll get dominated, I think, on pro. So let's try it. <laughs> let's see how fast I can die. Interface All enabled. right, interface enabled. Here we go. So we've got our orbital defense station, which is going to uh, scout some stuff for us, and. Then we've got our low orbit construction facility, which boosts the uh, the stuff that you're able to get from planets, the resources. That's what I'm looking for. We can recruit some fighters. Hyper distance chamber lets us travel a little bit further. So let's see if we can get over here. Yeah, that'll do nicely. So basically, when you're starting out, you just want to go around, conquer a bunch of planets. That's a pretty good thing to do. And let's zip back over here. Split that, and we can get back here as well. Now, we've got to build our low orbit construction facility in order to do some deep space scanning, and that basically will tell you where the enemy lies. So, let's do that, and uh, wait for our resources to build back up just a little bit, and continue conquering planets, so I can get those precious, precious resources. Obviously, any uh, RTS that you're playing, speed is a factor. This game doesn't really have a, a pause to it, so we just got to keep it moving, keep it going full steam. And I don't know what this is, but I'm going to try and take it over anyways, at least scout it out. Oh, just barely. <laughs> we made it, but just barely. All right, so let's scan a little bit beyond. Our enemy is thusly just there, so let's uh, move some more dudes up this way reinforce ourselves just a little bit and I want here as well maybe another construction facility here that should do nicely and then we've got all this stuff on the right which basically uh, defense array destroys 10 10 enemy ships that are trying to invade your space which is pretty nice um, you can slow the enemy down things like that you can also increase resources um, decrease fighter production to increase resources or the uh, the opposite of that which is generally pretty good I'm gonna go ahead and reinforce myself up here let's see how that enemy's doing over here 117 oh my god well that is his forward base so if we went and uh, slam that thing in the butt then we might be in pretty good shape should we try it let's try it just gotta, you know, hold on to your butts and uh, try and make some stuff happen. Early game domination. Domination! Alright, so we're looking pretty good here. But I'm going to have to try and hold this down, so let's move everybody over to this planet. If we're able. And uh, I'll reinforce myself just a little bit. What are these other planets? Yeah, he's not doing so hot. He's not such hot stuff. Don't worry about it. We hold it down over here. Basically, this is where I want all of my stuff to go. I do need to conquer this planet over here. So let's do that. Galactic Phase Array. Destroy five fighters in each enemy fleet, not ten. Okay. So we're going to try and hold this down as best we can over Mia. And... Oh, I've got plenty of fighters that, on these planets. Kind of forget about the ones in the back. Um, oh, I can't quite jump to this planet. Let's do the uh, hyper distance chamber. Increased. Travel distance increased. So now we can jump over to this planet over here. It's pretty interesting. There's a lot of hotkeys and stuff. Uh, although I, ha I, I don't have many of them memorized. Mostly depending on the mouse and stuff. But it's pretty nice that I'm able to do that. So... Let's uh, let's split this with right click and drag. You can split the fleet. You can also just uh, 
move your whole fleet with left click. Which generally, um, is not what I want to do. But yeah, I do want to grow faster than this guy, so let's build some, uh, some more defense arrays. You want to make sure you're spending all of your currency. Don't let it sit around being useless. Alright, we're looking pretty good now. Everybody move over here. Um, I'm just trying to reinforce myself over here. Alright. Orbital already present. Orbital already present. But that's the enemy's orbital array. I don't want that. Alright. Well, let's go conquer this planet, I suppose. It's not a bad game. It does seem to lack a little bit of inspiration, at least in my opinion, but it's fun enough to play. Especially as you climb up through the ranks and stuff like that. Let's uh, build a ODS over here. So we can spot any enemies that are trying to come our way. And I'm just going to keep moving. Keep moving my dudes around. Nothing in that upper left corner. So that scan was pretty useless. I can also build a star base. If uh, certain planets can't quite reach... Like this can't reach all the way to this planet. So I'll build a star base in the middle. So my guys can jump to this base and then to the planet. Although, obviously, the star base can be taken over by the enemy and stuff like that. So, I think online this would be a really nice thing. Um, if you're playing by yourself, then you either get stomped out <laughs> really fast, or, um, yeah. That's, that's what happens to me. I get stomped out really fast, or I destroy the computer really quick. It's either a win or extremely bad lose. <laughs> so... I can't quite scan over here because they still got their orbital defense. Okay. They got quite a few dudes. They could come and take this. Let's try and move all of my stuff to this star base. And then we can move it on up to the front line. Because it's not doing me any good back here. Oh my god! They just use a laser cannon. They got a death star. They got a death star! <laughs> oh, that's not good. So they destroyed the star base. They saw what I was trying to do there, jumping over that way. But that's all right. I've got this guy ready to go. Let's uh, we can't build a defense array. Damn it. LOCF online. All right, that's fine. Ludicrous speed increases travel speed. Quantum development tri will uh let let the fleet remain cloaked for the first half of travel, which seems really cool. But I'm unable to build it at the moment. Hmm, inverse polarity, electromagnetic pulse, turrets. Yeah, turrets seem like a good idea. Let's build a lot of turrets. Instantly scramble enemy sensors for 8 seconds. Enemy cannot see the size of a fleet while active. Well, I'm gonna just scan. keep trying to scan over here. Alright, let's take this planet. Let's make it happen. I'm tired of sitting around with my thumb up my butt. Alright, alright. And we need to reinforce this planet as we're moving, as they could take advantage. Enemy fighters have decloaked. Oh, snap! Oh boy. They're gonna try and get us. That's alright. I ain't too worried. Alright, they took their planet back, but I've got another fleet incoming. Sweet. So, I will keep them there for now. This planet is what's scaring me. This desert planet is uh, pretty pretty bulky at the moment. It's going to be pretty difficult to take that thing down. But we shall do our best. I'll move all these guys to the star base. And I kind of want to take this planet over, but let's, let's have a scan of it first. Okay. Only 30 over there. Alright, we'll make a star base and then I can jump to that planet. That would be nice. Uh, here you go. This'll work, this'll work. We're gonna take this enemy down. With extreme prejudice, maha! So, it seems, um, a little awkward that you can't move your, your fleet in any, in any kind of fashion other than half or the entire thing. Oh boy, they're coming over here. 
That defense array took down a few of them, but we are going to need some reinforcements. I don't even know where those things came from. Alright, we're going to win out. No problem. Let's scan that. And now they've opened themselves up, so... Let's do this. Enemy fighters have decloaked. Oh no! They're taking my star base! Alright, that's fine. We're pushing our way in. As it should be. Oh, I was not able to take that planet. They probably have a uh, defense array, defense something like that. Defense is improved! Come on, boys! We gotta do this thing. Alright, let's move these. We got a bunch of guys just sitting in the back doing nothing. Come on, fellas. Get up to the front lines. That's what I'm talking about. Don't you wanna fight? Don't you wanna win? Don't you want to make your country proud? Hell yeah, you do. I hope. So, resource extractor. I should probably put a resource, resource extractor on some of these planets that I'm not really using too too much. Scanning. All right, I should probably try and dive into this one. Oh, they're setting up right there. So, let's swap these around, reinforce that planet a little bit more. As spacemen are want to do. So we need a QDL, Quantum Development Laboratory. QDL online. Let's make it over here. Now we can do uh, ion missiles, doomsday, orbital archon, all this sort of stuff. That mad stuff that blew up my star base. And uh, hopefully that's going to go well. Let's get all these guys on the same planet so I can move them as one. For the greater good. The greater good. And I think being uh, offensive in this game is probably the way to go. You want to push your enemy as quickly as possible, which doesn't leave a whole lot of room for strategy, you know? Your enemy is obviously going to try and counter you in uh, some sort of different ways, but there's not a whole lot of ways that they're able to do so, if that makes sense. So I'm going to move in on this base over here, this little moon base. We took that over. Uh, get some. Defenses approved. Make some defenses. Defense! Boop, boop, boop. Defense! All right. Got some stuff going on back here. Just move it on up. Move it up, move it out! All righty. Come on, everyone together. That's how we want to do it. I should probably make another moon base, or star base, whatever you call it. Star base activated. Star base activated! Mmm, yes! I'm a robot! Robot master! Alright. Oh, I probably shouldn't have done that, because all these dudes are, are gearing up. Alright, we're still a little bit bigger. They have been pushed. They have been pushed back. Pushed to the brink! Oh boy. They got a bunch of dudes going over there for the starbase. Can we hold it off? Probably not. Oh my. It's bad. Wah! Shit. Probing. Oh my god. They've grown gigantic. I'm not sure how they got so big so quick. They must have a lot of planets in the back that I'm unable to see. Well. They're... Coming on for this this first planet that I took we should probably reinforce it just a little bit. Oh my Lasers lasers. Oh No It's going terribly All right, we should be able to take it back relatively quickly though Ah, That's not good. This is gonna get ugly so fast. That was a big fleet they, they threw at us. But we're alright. We hanging in there for now. Everybody move over this way. Just bolster those defenses. The, the computer's not really taking time and building any star bases or anything like that. So I consider myself lucky. Although it might just be the lower difficulty of the game. But I'll take it. Shit. <laughs> Alright, so we've got some stuff going on back here. That's pretty nice. What do you have over here? 
Yeah, they got a couple bases. Just waiting in the wings. But I ain't too scared. I ain't never scared. Never scared. Alright. Since they're not attacking anything but these two planets that are in their zone, we can not worry too much. Just move all our dudes together. Mob it. Really simple gameplay <laughs> at the moment. Um, where's that starbase? There we go. Kind of want to connect all these dudes together. Starbase activated. Make it a little bit easier to jump around. That's a good idea. We should also probably scan them again. Oh yeah. They're gearing up. Gearing up over there. For a little bit of attack. Hmm. Could do the FTL drive. Warp 30% of your fighters to any friendly planet that has an orbital. Oh, that's really nice. Then they're just like, hey, I'm over here now. Cool. So, when you're moving with uh, the highlight thing, ships are only going to jump as far as they're able to, obviously. But um, if you just highlight and click on the same planet over and over, Eventually, all the ships are going to get there, but it is something to keep in mind, for sure, at least. It's not, it's not bad. This game is really, really simple. I was having a hard time making an episode for it just because it is so simple, but I don't think simplicity is necessarily a bad thing. Um, it definitely is a game that has some passion into it, and there is some modicum of strategy, although right now I, I find it either extremely difficult or way too easy. Like right now I'm just obviously plundering the butts of all these planets. It doesn't really matter what the enemy does at this point because I've got mass control of the solar system. Which is kinda nice. I really like to control the solar system. Isn't that super? So there we go. Just uh, getting all my dudes up in the same place. Oh no no, not you! Oh shit. Go back over there! Go back over there! Uh-oh, we need our warp drive. Increasing travel speed. Increasing travel speed! Go, go, go! Oh boy. That's a close one. They took it back. They took it back because of a misclick. I'm so upset. Alright. Just push it. Push it! Yeah! Rocket! Yeah! So, be sure not to highlight planets that you don't mean to move a shit ton of ships away from. There's a, a tip. A handy hint for life. Alright. Let's get everybody moved to this moon base, if possible. Do 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 There we go. That's looking pretty good. All nice and reinforced now. And let's have another scan of what the enemy's up to. They think they're gonna do some shit with these fighters over here. I don't. I don't think you gotta do a goddamn thing. He's a bitch. I can smell it on you. I smell the bitch in you. Alright. Let's get all of these dudes ready. We're gonna take some more stuff. Take some more stuff. That's what I do now. Alright, they're making a dive for this planet. Hit that FTL. Do -do 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 -do. Reinforce! Reinforce! Ha ha ha! Conquered! With extreme prejudice, yes! Alright. Let's go on, move it in. Move it on in, boys. They ain't got no gas left. They don't have no fight left in them. Oh god. Well, there's a little uh, problem that I can foresee. Oh no. This is not. Friendly planet required. Friendly planet. Alright, here's a friendly planet. Oh, we're gonna lose out again. Come on. Come on. Shit. Alright. Scoot it up, boys. Scoot it in! Oh wow. We just barely were able to take that Scanning. thing. 
Well, they've got a good amount of dudes. Oh, shit. No, no, no! No! Ludicrous speed, go! Oh, shit! Doomsday device online. Well, we doomsday deviced them, but I think we also doomsday deviced ourselves. So, that's bad. Alright. I need to stop fighting and get my dudes in the position. It's not going well for me at the moment. Jump up here. Can this planet reach? Yeah, it can. Alright, so I'll reinforce this as well. This is what we started with. <sighs> hmm. ODS online. ODS online! Do not take that planet from me. Build some turrets Defense real quick. Yeah! Defense! Boop, boop, boop. Take this planet back so I can move some more stuff up. That would be a good idea. Enemy fighters All right. decloaked. Enemy fighters. I'm scared of you. What you think you're gonna do? Huh? Alright, I don't want to move anything from there quite yet. Let's zip, zap, zoop it about. Get all these guys up in the front. That's what has to happen now. Um, jump to this planet. Good lord. Should we try the, uh, the Doomsday Archon? Yeah. Yeah! Oh, they're gonna be able to take that. Reinforce! Reinforce! And then I'll swoop that planet from you. Thank you so much! They're just feeding me. Feed me! I'm hungry, Seymour! I want to grow bigger, stronger, faster. Alright, so basically all they can reach is th these three planets in the front. So that's really nice. I'm gonna be able to crawl all of my fleet up there. Enemy and then you're fucked. Cooked. That's it. It's over for you. Alright. They don't have too many over there. I could take them down. Should we build a star base? Star base assembled. Are we gonna are we gonna get a Death Star? We getting a Death Star! Alright. Move it on up, fellas. This is the end times. Those enemies, they thought they was something. But they ain't nothing. So, 214 over here. That's a pretty good amount. I, unfortunately, I don't think it's going to be enough to save you. They're going to blow up the star base, which is just fine. That means I can swoop this. Swoop it up. Swoop it and loop it. So they're going back to the other home base. Going back to the other home base! Oh yeah. So that was a star base. That was not a planet of theirs. Victory! We've done it. We've done it, friends. We smashed them up real good. Yeah. Basically, if you're gonna play this game, slam the enemy, and they will not be able to regain their balance. Unless they're human, or unless they're an extremely difficult AI. And uh, we might do an episode where I just get my butt slammed over and over, but that's not as fun as a victory. I'll tell you that right now. Anyways, Dominari Tournament. It's not completely terrible. If it looks like something that you'd enjoy, then you'd probably enjoy it. I'd say that it could use a bit more uh, depth. I'd like to see some random events and things thrown in, because right now the only thing that's randomly generated is where the planets are placed, which does offer a bit of, um, a, bit of a difference between each game. But I think it could be improved upon further. Anyways, friends, this has been Dominari Tournament. I've been Brandon Dayton, your humble narrator. If you did enjoy the episode, please don't forget to like, comment, and or subscribe. We've also got links in the description to Twitter, Discord, Patreon. If you'd like to contact me on any of those, I would be so, so appreciative. Anyways, once again, this has been Dominari Tournament. I've been Brandon Dayton, your humble narrator. I will see you next week with something a little different. And until then, friends, bye-bye. One, two, three, four. Goodbye, goodbye, see you again. Goodbye, goodbye, see you, my friends.